actually I think you did exactly what you were supposed to do so what I usually recommend to folks who are looking to monetize Facebook is that if you have a page then absolutely go ahead and use it but in your instance the comment you made is really true, right? You might have some content that you really don't want your other friends and family to see. That is where either a business page comes into effect or you can start a whole new different profile. Once you start that profile, there's a couple of things you need to keep in, your, in the back of your mind as you're kind of creating content for this page. Number one is to make sure that it's targeted to a specific audience. I know we're in the era of everybody saying I don't have a niche, um, but the reason why we're telling you all to really define who you're speaking to is because you want the algorithm to realize who they should send to your page, right? So if you are McDonald's versus Taco Bell, right? McDonald's serves hamburgers, fries, and the occasional fish sandwich and a chicken sandwich here and there, right? <laughs> Taco Bell, tacos, Taco Bell, uh, burritos, and the occasional tostada or whatever else they sell. I don't know. I don't go to neither one of these no more because I'm too old and then my stomach can't handle it. But anywho, that's not the point. Point here is two different things. And when you identify and you create content specifically to those audience, they're going to send you people that want hamburgers directly to your page. Or if you're going to be Taco Bell, they're going to send you people that want tacos. Does that make sense? Make sure your content is targeted. Another thing I would also recommend is that you create on multiple or that you post on multiple pages okay so you're creating video content post the video content post the static you know images just image content but make sure you're posting more videos than static images because you're going to get paid more for your video content uh, than your static images in some instances in most instances actually uh, so make sure you're posting more video now take that same video and post it on not only on Facebook but create an Instagram page with that same name um, I'm losing my, my lashes hold on bring my lashes back uh, create an Instagram page with that same name, create a TikTok page with that same name, post the video content and whatever content to both of those pages. That way you're not only getting paid by one platform, you're getting paid by multiple platforms. Uh, secondly, or did I say second already? Anyway, next, <laughs> make sure that you are posting to YouTube if you're really wanting to take your monetization to a whole nother level. There's no reason why you shouldn't be taking the same content that you're posting on one platform and posting it on multiple and getting paid three to four times for one piece of content. Uh, another piece I want to add in there is make sure you're building an email list. I know that it's passe to say that, right? We're like, oh, the platforms are paying us now. They could take that away at any time they feel like it. Make sure you're building an email list and your content is specific to that email list so you can contact them at any time that you choose to or text message, whichever one you feel.